So the most common psychiatric conditions are mood disorders, which includes depression, bipolar disorder, and then sub subclasses of the same, like cyclothymias and bipolar two and um, long-term depressions and dysthymias. Uh, a lot of anxiety disorders, um, which manifest themselves as either social anxiety, panic disorder, generalized anxiety disorders. Uh, we also treat people, actually a large number of people with post-traumatic stress disorder. Um, often post-traumatic stress disorder is linked to war and veterans, post-traumatic stress uh, and or sexual abuse issues. It really is much more broader than that. Even witnessed trauma can be huge. Um, and so there are various aspects of traumas that manifest themselves in, in, the, in the shape and form of even addictions and our eating disorders and our um, mood disorders and so forth. Um, so we treat other conditions such as obsessive compulsive disorder, uh, schizophrenia, uh, schizoaffective disorder, um, and um, um, some eating disorders uh, fall into uh, treatment as well. Uh, so these are the most common conditions. And then we also treat people with uh, suboxone for those who may have narcotic dependence and or other ways to help them, uh, given the epidemic of uh, pain, disorder, uh, pain medicine and or narcotic dependence. Uh, we have a unique program to offer uh, treatment which will last for longer time. Uh, in, in addition, adjustment disorders and marital difficulties and challenges within relationships and so forth. So we offer a wide variety of psychiatric treatments encompassing um, the usual adult psychiatry treatments uh, as well as addiction-related care.